Hello, this is Mike of the Enough Dice, and you're watching the Kibble Space Program. I am kind of mucking about today, uh, for no good reason. Uh, I made a very small rover, and I've put an engineer in my very small rover. Lemsel, Lemsel Kerman. And I'm heading towards this thing, what I've made. Um, it's a piece of foolishness. I'm not quite sure why I'm doing it. Um, basically what this is, is a mining rig. Um, theoretically you could put one of those on a planet, but the way it's set up, I'm not sure, because it's got wheels and wheels of, uh, I always find wheels difficult to, to manage. Uh, although I might be able to go back if I, if I start, I might be able to do something, stop, 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 stop. stop. Stop, stop, even more. Actually, stop this time. There you go. Wow, I was going faster than I expected. Anyway, sorry. Um, I might be able to use a kibble, uh, an infernal robotics thing, where um, the wheels kind of are, can be centrally mounted and then. Um, yeah, I, 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 I was doing some stuff along, along those lines before. That's not what I wanted to do. Oh, I wanted to look at that. There you go. I put way too much unnecessary electric charge on this, but never mind. So put the brakes on. Boom. Now, can we get out? And then. I uh, just noticed that I'm not going to be able to get back in there, never mind. If it all goes wrong, he's going to have a bit of a walk. Um, yeah, so now the thing about mining stations is, or, is that um, well, there's many things about mining stations, actually. Uh, one is, if you look at this one that I put together, that's how many nuclear reactors, that the, those top there, that's how many nuclear reactors it's taking to power those um, mining arms. Well, I put some extra on just for other things. Um, I was going to put lights on, then I've got I forgot to put lights on. Now, can I? Now, what I'm testing here is can I board the thing? And I'm beginning to think no. Ooh, that's annoying. I was, I wanted, I, I, I put a cupola on here for really um, aesthetic reasons. Um, what I want to do eventually is to uh, get an engineer in here. That's slightly irritating. Is to get, like I say, to get an engineer in here um, because that's supposed to increase the um, the speed at which you can you can um, mine things, but can't get in there. So I thought that ladder would be enough because you think you think logically, if there's a ladder there and then your hatch is there, that you'd be able to um, to get in. But the game does not believe the game does not share my belief. Oh, that's aggravating. So it looks like what I'm going to have to do is create something um, with the right with a um, docking port and then dock with it. How aggravating! Uh, can I just? Well, if I go here, oh no, I still grabbed the ladder. I was, I was I was hoping it might it might be able to let go. Can I can I get it to grab this ladder? Ooh, maybe if I jump. No, it looks like not. If I, it looks like I bashed my head before I I I put registers that I've got. Or you just can't grab while you're jumping, which would which would be fair. To be perfectly honest. Wow, everything's running slow. So. <laughs> 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 
Poor little mite, he keeps hitting his head um, as soon as I try and do anything. Can I get in there? Come on. Oof. I think that's actually attempting to climb it. So, so, would I be able to do it, I wonder? Cool. What about do it? If I put the, the hatch here, if I just rotated this thing, uh, but then the, the, the problem is the hatch is going to be straight in where those uh, wheels are, where the, the landing gear is. How aggravating. Nope. And look, I doubt I'm going to get back into here either. Not that it matters. I mean, I, I can just. Um, wow, things are running slow. I wonder if I've just got too many things. I mean, uh, this is a reasonably high p part count object, uh, given that there are 40. Um, 46 uh, just nuclear reactors on it. So it's highly radioactive. <laughs> I'm sure it's not good for anybody. Um, oh, he keeps bonking his head for that. Uh, ooh. That worked. Okay. So I can board that. Oh, there we go. We'll, we'll board that and take that back. So it looks like I'm going to have to make a thing that will allow docking. Which means either if, if I either have to reconstruct that entire um, object, the the the, the mining station entirely. Um, or do something else. So it looks like that cupola on the front there is completely pointless, uh, given that I'm going to have to dock anything, dock a pilot transfer thing. So let's get rid of that. So let's have, let's have a land can. Let's have a go for a big one. It's going to, uh, have a bod inside it. Actually, I don't know if you can control from here. Um, no, you must be able to. Yeah, you must be able to because that's that's how you land things. Um, what I'm also going to do is I'm also going to whack a. If I remember where I keep things, let's put a big fuel tank on it. Because the point of having a right, why, why would I? Why would I have a mining rig on? And I'm changing my mind already. No. There we go. I'm changing my mind already. Uh, why would I want a mining rig? Um, on Kerbin. Well, I'm glad you asked. Um, I'm coming to the end of the the tech tree, right? So I'm coming to a point where um, I'm coming to a point where I really should have been using a, a, a mirror modifier. There you go. Boop. I'm coming to the end of the science tree. Uh, so there's, there's going to become a point where there's not a huge amount of reason to... Um, that one. There's not a huge amount of reason in terms of just pure science um, to go um, exploring. 
Oh, for heaven's sake, I can never work out which way there. Uh, is that. Yeah, I can't work. Well, blah, 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 blah. Right. Working out which of the movement keys moves it the way I want to move it. There we go, that's what I want. Anyway, so there's going to come a point where there's not a huge amount of reason to go into space in terms of science. So it's going to be at that point, um, I want to get to places I haven't been to. Um, I want to um, explore all planets, put flags on everything. Uh, maybe do like missions, like the first the first mission to get uh, from point A, yeah, wherever. Um, and at which point, uh, you know, there's there's issues about money and and um, if I'm not going places for scientific reasons. Um, where am I getting my money from? And one of the, the things you can do is I'll just, I'm just putting that on there. I don't probably never going to need this, but there you go. Make a little rover, and I'll put a crew of. I believe only one engineer counts. So where's my engineer? I've got two engineers. I'm going to put them both. Well, I'll put them both. So what the theory is, if you get m you want money, and I didn't actually mean to launch right there, but doesn't mind. In order to get money, um, if you're not doing missions, or if there are missions that there aren't any missions that, that appeal to you, what you can do is you can set up a mining thing on Kerbin, and do mining convert the ore to monopropellant monopropellant is definitely the uh, the best bang for your buck apparently it's it's it just it just costs more for a given amount of, of ore converting it into into monoprop gives you the most money Whee. This is also now thinking about a bit of a ow. That went wrong. Uh, I think what happened was I, I hit the slope too hard coming down that way, and everything fell apart. It wasn't that entertaining. The main, I uh, didn't kill anyone, so, you know, I don't feel too bad about reverting. I don't feel bad about reverting at all. What, I'm just, li you know, I, if, I can, if I say otherwise, I'm just lying. Um, I'm not playing hardcore mode. I really, maybe I should be. Maybe I should be playing hardcore mode. Um, but I'm not, so there you go. But the main, the main benefit of not playing hardcore mode is that I would have to tidy everything up. There we go. What? Hang on a minute. What's going on here? I was going like zero miles an hour when that happened. Uh, might I wonder if it's as simple as that hits. That's just low enough that it'll smash into the ground if I'm not. Alright. Go awfully carefully. Just, you know. I wonder if that is in fact what's going on. It's just that bit there is kind of digging into the ground when it hits the when it l leaves the slope. Let's go as slowly as possible.
There we go. There we go. I have to be very gentle with that thing as well. Uh, it being rather huge and unwieldy. Now here's an it. This is going to be entertaining. And by entertaining, I mean really irritating. Slow down! And by slow down, I mean actually slow down. There we go. See, there, there are things you can't do <coughs> in a wheeled craft that you, you can do in a spacecraft. Like go sideways. Um, uh, I mean, there are, there are rover designs which allow you to do that. Um, So ideally what I want is to be off to one side and then I put my gears down. Um, I'll get jammed. I wonder if that's not causing a problem. I was a bit, to be perfectly honest, a little worried about that when I those because that's from the that's from the landing gear, which I put there. Uh, to to give the whole thing a bit of support. Ah, oh, this is really aggravating. Da, 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 da. This is really aggravating. Let's go back a little bit. Yeah, it's not pulling me up enough. Nerf, nerf, nerf. Uh, they, they, they're just done extending, which I rather subscribe. I'm going to get back, so I'm definitely far away from it. Whoa, that was bad. No, oh, it's just not lifting the same amount. It's exceeding aggravating. Well, so much for that idea. Oh, well, I'm going to have to try something else. <laughs> mm, docking, it's hard. Um, and making craft that do what you think they're going to do is also hard. Um, I wonder if I might not want to do uh, an Infernal Robotics thing, as always, which is my new toy. Uh, basically, everything gets fixed with the Infernal Robotics now. Um, yeah, they just don't, they just, the, the legs aren't extending as much as those ones. Yeah, well there you go. So I might have a, a very quick go. Um, the quickest thing I think that'll fix it, if it's just that the it's too heavy for the legs, is just to create more legs. I just realized something as well. I don't want anything in here. I want this to be an empty I want these to be empty tanks. Which may I may or may not help. I should, have, I should have made note of um, how much it was before and how much it is after. Uh, make sure the crew's who I want it to be. Yes. Well, I'm going to have one more go. I'm going to see what happens. Um, and if not, I'm just going to go there. Uh, I'll probably have to redesign the, um, the whole 
concept and if that doesn't work because I'll need some way of getting crew on board well I need to do two things I need to be able to um, dock because the whole point is I'd want to dock empty fuel cans right I'd want to dock empty fuel cans with that um, whoa that was entertaining um, I'd want to dock empty fuel cans with it so that I can get um, The, the whole point is that I'm going to want to to goodness me look at that doing a wheelie doing a stoppy actually if I think if I, if I remember remember this right uh, oh this is bad this is possibly going to involve a crash yes I wonder if there's no. <laughs> what happened there? Oh, it's not even actually crashed. So if I if I can go backwards, everything should. Uh, no, it has in fact fallen off. Only that makes no sense because what? Oh, I see. I see. I'm, I'm just rolling around the land again at this point. I'm not actually controlling. The whole land again just fell off. Like it wasn't really properly attached at all. That's just madness. <laughs> all right, well that went well. That achieved everything I could have wanted it to achieve. No, wait, it didn't. Uh, that, that's highly embarrassing. I don't know what even, I didn't even know what happened there. Where, where you know, what, what am I connected to? That's the... Wow, I'm over here now. Right, that's my big rig. Okay, my big rig, which has, I mean, all that got 0 0.54 ore. Um, and now I've got that, which has fallen over. Oh, what a ridiculous thing to occur. To occur. Anyway, enough of this. I've failed. I'm a dismal, dismal failure. Uh, <laughs> Anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, yeah, like and subscribe, all that kind of stuff. Uh, Neil of Dice, Neil of Dice .com, Also on Facebook and Twitter. And until next time, glue your bits on properly, clearly, is what you need to do. <laughs>